Good morning, YouTube. Today it is a little bit rainy and cloudy. We are going to see a trailer we manufactured for our New Zealand client. We call it Lobat inside the container terminal. It will be used in Auckland Wharf, Auckland Port, to carry different cargo, such as containers and loose cargo from the vessel. It's multi-purpose use. Inside the terminal, terminal company will need not only the roll trailer, but also this type of uh, drop deck trailer to carry the cargo from the roll on, roll off, from the bulk vessel, from the container vessel, and to deliver it to the pointed position and to stock it. We produce this trailer for MTE, the company who is located at New Zealand, and they have the inquiry from their client, who might be the terminal operation company, require this trailer. Let's see the details of this trailer. First, the landing gear. The landing gear is one side operation. As you can see, New Zealand is a right drive. So we put the landing gear operation at the left side so the driver can operate safely. This plate here is to avoid if it is carrying the big machine. The wheels won't stuck into the gooseneck. So these two plates will stop the wheel at there. And the container locks we can see here, it is using to transport a different size of containers. We have 12 locks here for two 20 foot and one 40 foot or one 20 foot uh, containers. We use three or four millimeter checked plate at the deck, which means the surface of the trailer is anti-stocking with more force to make sure the cargo stay on top of the deck without moving. The side guard here is to warrant people or car running under the chassis to avoid the accident. Here you can see our logo here again. A very small toolbox because this is inside the terminal all the time with the maintenance team and the, the rescue all the time. So the toolbox do not need so big. The tire is a tubeless tire and the axle we are using FUWA. It's ISO rim with 10 dot, and suspension we are using is also different to the normal trailer. It is a little bit uh, lower to make sure the axle with a gap. The length of the deck is 12.5 meter for one 40 foot container. So as you can see, the rear axle is a little bit far from the rear bumper, the rear guard. The light we are using is simple because it is inside the port, does not need that fancy. As you can see, the warning light and the warning plate at here, it can reflect the light to give the behind drivers attention. And this is a license plate to put the license on. Those two blocks are for the forklift to push it if necessary. Because this trailer is going to use and operate inside the container terminal all the time. So the braking system and the light system, we does not apply DOT. Hopefully we can deliver more th this type of trailer to New Zealand in near future. And the, in this side, we don't have a two box and we only have a one piece side guard to protect the side. Many clients was asking the life of the trailer and today we are going to see a little bit which related to the service life of the trailer. As you can see this trailer is very simple. The main part is axle. So if we can maintain the axle correct, this trailer could last almost uh, forever. And I have experience to see some trailer at Vietnam port has been used for 30 years. Please do follow the menu of us 
and the mounting the axle on time. And the first, you need to remove the hub and uh, clean all the grease from inside the axle. If you see the grease is black, which means it is mixed uh, with uh, dust and uh, rust. So if you leave those dark things inside, it will keep damaging your axle, your bearing, and everything, every part inside the axle. So you need to remove all those black greasing first and re-put the new greasing to make sure it is uh, clean. And the second thing you need to double check uh, the boat every week or every month before you drive it. So you can see we put a mark on, on the boat. So if you see the mark has been moved, such as if the line is here and this line moves to here, and which means you need to check the torque of the boat if it is fastened enough. As long as you can maintain this trailer correct, so you can avoid accident. The accident is really the killer of the service life of the trailer. So hope every of our client will have a long service life, which means uh, you will like our product and uh, keep buying from us. Okay, that's all for today. I hope everyone enjoys the video, and if you like. Uh, our trailer, please uh, click the sum up and or you can send us an email at any time for any question. A little bit hot and uh, it is going to rain today. Hope you have a nice day everyone.